Hello, welcome to Combative Wing Chun. I'm Sifu David. Welcome to Wing Chun Dummy Training Techniques, also called Mok Yang Zhong in Chinese. In this video series, you're going to see 116 Wing Chun Wooden Dummy Training Techniques, 116 moves from Yip Man's Wooden Dummy Form. I'm going to show you each move step by step with the action cam so you have the best way to learn the Wing Chun form at home. Make sure you subscribe and click the bell for notifications so you don't miss a single lesson in this series. Here we go. So the first, these are the first two moves, and the third move is Bong Sao. So we are here in move number two, move number three will be do Bong Sao. So we're going to flip it around and do Bong Sao. So from, this, from the front, it looks like this. This is in your center line, this is your Bong Sao, your finger is pointing that way, it's relaxed, and your elbow is higher than the wrist. This is will be around your sternum level. And these are all both on the same line here in the center line. Okay, so on the dummy, you end up here. And now we just go in here. Okay, so notice I'm making contact with this and also this with this arm. Okay, there's no pushing. There is no, um, no sinking. Just make contact, that's all you need to do. Okay, so from number of two, this hand moves here, this hand moves here, from here to here, from here to here. Okay, from here to here. This one goes from here to here. So at the same time, we go here, here, here. Okay, so it's a move of number three. From here, the bong sao, we're going to first step over to the corner, and then we're going to move this feet to this side of the lower arm, I mean lower leg, and then we're gonna pivot this way. So that's the feet. Starting from here, I mean we're, we're in this position, so we're gonna step to this corner. This one steps to here on the uh, switched sides of the uh, lower, arm, lower leg, and then we're gonna shift. Now we're facing 45 degrees towards the dummy, and now the weight of your foot is 70% left foot uh, and 30% right foot. Okay, so you one smooth motion you're here. Okay, so once again, uh, we pivot it to this way, we step this way, and then we pivot back this way. Now we're um, 45 degrees. Okay, so we ended up with the bomb cell. And what we want to do with the hands, just the hands, is we're going to move and then we're going to flip it to a tan cell. So we're here, flip it to a tan cell. The bong cell, flip it to a tan cell. Bong cell, flip it to a tan cell. Okay, so that's the move. This hand doesn't move. It stays in your Wu Sao position. All you're doing is from here, and then keep contact, keep contact, keep contact, and it flips to the Tan Sao. This is, index finger is still pointing into the center of the dummy. And that is the Wu Sao. Okay, there's an ending position here. Your weight is on your back foot here. Uh, your feet are pointing 45 degrees. Shoulders down, Wu Sao is here and you're facing, looking at the dummy. So that is uh, move number four. Number three, step, step, shuffle, and do the tonsil at the same time. So from here, I mean pivot and do the tonsil. Pivot and do the tonsil. Pivot and do the tonsil. And then the next move, 
is we're just gonna go turn this into a low palm. Okay. And there's a tiny little movement here, just shuffle a little bit. Okay. So there's this tiny shuffle. There's a tiny move forward, shuffle. That's it. So tiny forward, tiny bit forward. So at the same time, movement number five is that's your feet, moving forward slightly. Move number five. And now you combine it with the low palm. Okay? Like that. So while this keeps the tons up. Up here. That's move number five. Okay, so we're going pretty quickly. Let's start from move number three, your bong so. Slowly step, step, pivot. That's move number four. Move number five is slight shuffle forward and low palm, and this time so stays up here. All right, so that's move number three to five. Let's do number th move three to five a little bit slower. So we're here in our bong so, and then we're going to step to the corner, move this foot to this side of the lower leg, pivot this to this side, the upper hand turns into a uh, tan sao, wu sao here, here, step five is step in a little bit, and as you shuffle forward and back foot, do the palm, this stays as a tan sao up here. That is the move number five. So those are moves number three to five. Okay, correction. We made a little mistake here. This is three and this is four. So uh, it's not four and five. So four and five, I just explained, it's actually just one move, four. So you can call this three, four and a half. Okay, I just want to separate it so that you make it a little bit clearer. But in actual, according to the 116 move, this is three, Four. It happens at the same time. So when I'm turning, pivoting, and palming at the same time, this is one move. Four. Okay, so now we end in the four. Move number five will be to switch it to a gan zam sao. Okay, so I'm uh, here, you switch it to here. So I'll just do it quickly. Uh, uh, number five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we're going to go through that sequence. So here's the hand movements for 4 to 10 from the front angle. This is the 4, there's the Tan Sao and the Low Zhe, the Dai Zhe, right? So from 4, we go 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, one more time. We ended up at four. So it's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So let's do it over my shoulders so you can see. The same thing on the dumber, dummy. Four. So we have four here. Okay, so now you can see it over my shoulders over the, uh, in the dummy, starting in position four, position five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's how you do it on the dummy. If you like this lesson, make sure you click the like button and share it with your friends. And also subscribe and click the notification bell for all the latest lessons that are coming out. If you want to continue your training, just click the next video to keep watching.